Very, very good boat. You can hold steady. I can't reach it. It saves so much work. I believe I can break it off. Oh, it's nothing. Looks gorgeous. Uh, I got stuck in the door. Old timer vibe. Halberg Rossi's. It's a Halberg Rossi 34. Supposed to be very, very good boat. Look. You can hold steady. You have double indicators completely. I don't know if it's that important, but if you want a motor, you now the motor is only on one side. Again, in this weird position here. I can't reach it. Am I to do it with my foot? You got light control here. That's fancy. Very nice. Large spacious cockpit. And that's invaluable, just the space where all the lines fall into. It saves so much work. This is also nice. It has a little bit of solar, but let's face it, it's a laughable amount. With this block, you can actually uh, trim the mainsail without a winch, which is, it's a smaller boat, and it's nice, you can do that. But again, look, there is a grip. I can grip here when I'm moving, and then I have to style um, somewhere here without any grips. Look, it's not, it's not a grip as well. I believe I can break it off. Okay, it's a nice feature. When you're standing here in the galley, you can stand here with the wall. This is good engineering in the top the way. And you can actually like that. You can much better um, hold steady if you have to cook in some sea. And there is also a large opening here and here. So you can let the smoke or whatever from your oven go out. Watch it! Oh, it's nothing! A small, really small refrigerator. Garbage. This is... These are tidy, just look at this. Looks gorgeous. Some oh flat screen TV. Why not? This is quite spacious for a thirty-four foot boat piece. Yeah, I can live with that. And there's a curtain so you protect the door. Not like on the Janos. I don't believe this would survive too long with nice frequent showers. You can also look up. It always gives you a little bit of space. Uh, I got stuck in the door. Watch it. Okay, it's a hanging locker actually. Here you can close off your front cabin, but what does it, like, why? I understand it's an owner boat being that small, but still, this doesn't give you any more privacy. These inside are nice. And I like this one. It's a nice feel to it. They don't have to push it. Okay, it doesn't have a nice feel. Lots of storage. Storage is always good. Mm. 
nice that they are still working with some... Okay, it's not wood, it's plastic. Not nice. And I can't really stand in here. Moving back to the salon, this is also a nice element look. It gives you a little bit about your boat, it doesn't take too much space. You have to polish it, I guess, but still. Um, nice. But still, you know, a little bit of an old, old timer vibe. Okay, this is definitely not a navigation table. It barely qualifies as a table. But that's a really good thing, you see? Everything is very uh, labeled and ready for you to work or fix it. But it's, uh, this is laughable. You can't even stand here. But I guess they included double cockpits uh, where you can navigate, so maybe it's not that bad. It's a wide bed, nice one. And very nice with these. I still don't know, this is some kind of, I don't know if it's wood, maybe it's plastic, but it's, I believe it's supposed to save weight. It's some, it's somewhat understandable, but I like this windows, large. Also windows in the cockpit. And uh, doesn't have standing headroom. But it has a large locker also, although it doesn't have any anything where you can put anything in here. This concludes our Halbeck Rossi.